YouTube. Today we are going through JavaScript algorithms and data structures in the basic JavaScript course. We are on number 13 of 113, so we're we're, we're getting through it. Uh, today we are going to multiply two numbers with JavaScript. So the same as our previous lessons, um, we can use the asterisk, which is the multiplication sign on a computer, uh, to multiply two numbers. So the product of 8 times 0, we want to change the 0 so it'll be 80. Okay, so constant product is equal to whatever the outcome, whatever the product <laughs> product of these two numbers multiplied by each other are. So to make this 80, we can simply add a 1 here. So 8 times 10 is 80, and now our product is 80. So that is, that is all it takes to multiply in JavaScript. Once again, if we console log product, we're going to get 80, and if we change this to 100, we're going to get 800. Whatever these, the product of these two are, is stored in product, and we can refer to it because it is a constant, uh, a variable that we refer to.